everyone, thank you so much for joining me today. My name is Katie, Babe. and this channel is the place to go if you want to grow and you've hit a I've musical plateau. You, this is what the play along sounds like for I've Got You, Babe. I've got you, babe. I've got you, babe. I've got so I'm seven months pregnant right now and by the time that you see this I'll probably have had the baby so just kind of batch filming for maternity leave hope you like this finger picking rendition this is great if you're introducing finger picking or if you have your handle on your cords this is a great way to introduce it first we have a G chord my finger number three is going to be on the third fret of the E string and fingers one and two on the second fret of the A and the C string C chord, finger number three, third fret of the A string. And then D, I play my D all three fingers in a row, where I take fingers one, two, and three, and I place them on the second fret of the G, C, and the E string this way. I've seen it done this way, where there's a double up, where my finger number one is pushing down on two strings, and finger number two is pushing down on this string, which is the second string. I've seen it done this way. You choose your own adventure. And then we have an A minor seven, okay? It's really, really complicated. Just kidding. <laughs> it's just all of your strings open in a row. Pretty fun. Now, if you don't feel like finger picking, you could just strum this song. And the strumming pattern that I would be using would be one, two, and three, and one, two, and three, and. So we have down, down, up, down, up. So each down, down, up, down, up is going to be equal to three counts or one measure. So if I were to strum it, we'd have our G chord and it would be down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up. One, two, and three, and one, two, and C chord. One, two, and three, and 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 one, two and three and one two and then a d chord one two and three and 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 one so when i get to the chorus the babe i've got you babe we have our g to our c <laughs> just the down down up down up down down up c chord get to the bridge that I've got flowers in the spring same string uh, sorry same strumming pattern except we are going to play the a minor 7 to the D and then it just repeats the verse I didn't put any key change in there now if you're feeling Olympic and you want to try some finger picking this is a very great way to introduce finger picking into your repertoire if you have gotten a good hold of your chords so this is what we're going to do I'm going to assign my thumb to the C string and then fingers one and two will be assigned to the E string and the A string. So my thumb will pluck the C string and then fingers one and two on my right hand will pluck the A and the E string together. So we have one, two, three, one, two, three. And then when I move to a C chord, I pluck the same strings. One, two, three, one, two, three. That is going to be consistent throughout the entire song. So this is what it would sound like. So we have our G. Let's try it. One, two, three. One, two, three. Thumb, fingers, fingers, thumb. Fingers, fingers, C, thumb. Fingers, fingers, thumb. Fingers, fingers, G. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three three, one, two, three, and then we have our D chord. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. You notice that I'm only plucking these three strings, strings one, two, and three, but string number four, I'm not plucking it, but I'm still holding it in the chord. I'm still holding my pointer finger down here on the fourth string. The reason why is that just in case you're finger picking and you were, you know, you accidentally play the G string right here, then it happens like versus if you leave it open. 
might sound a little cool, but in other cases it may not. So it's kind of like a safeguard just in case. All right, now when we get to the chorus, of course we have the G to the C. I've got you, babe. I've got you, babe. I've got you, babe. For the bridge, we have A minor 7 to a D chord, and then we have G, C, C to D. Same finger picking pattern. So we have A minor 7, all open strings. I've got thumb, fingers, fingers, thumb, fingers, fingers, thumb, fingers, fingers, thumb. D chord. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, open. D chord. All right, here comes a G. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, C chord. We have our C chord. <laughs> Almost forgot there. Then D chord. And then we go back into a verse and a chorus. Now in the play along, you're going to see me mix the finger picking and the strumming. You can choose whatever you would like to do. Strumming only, finger picking only, or mixture like I've done it. It's just, I wanted to give you some options so that you can mix things up, practice what you need to practice. The play along is next, and I made a video on how to slow down or speed up any YouTube video. I'm gonna put that in the cards above in the description box below so that you can either speed the song up or slow it down just depending upon what you're working on. Okay, that's next. One, two, three, one, two, three. They say we're young and we don't know. We won't find out until we grow. Well, I don't know if all that's true. But you've got me, and baby, I've got you. Babe. I've got you, babe. I've got you, babe. I've got you, babe. They say our love won't pay the rent. Before it's earned, our money's all been spent. I guess that's so, we don't have a pot. At least I'm sure of all the things we've got. Babe. I've got you, babe. I've got you, babe. I've got you, babe. I've got flowers in the spring. I've got you to wear my ring. And when I'm sad, you're the clown. And I get scared. You're always around Don't let them say our hair's too long I don't care with you, I can't go wrong Then put your little hand in mine Ain't no hill or mountain we can't climb
I've got you, babe. I've got you, babe. I've got you, babe. I've got you, babe. Thank you so much for supporting me and watching this and you're supporting not only me, but my family. I just thank you so much. I love you. If you want more videos like this, I have so many other videos that are all in the cards around me and I will see you in the next one. Hopefully leave a comment, subscribe, like, I love you. See you later. Bye. <laughs> that was really fun. Yay. Okay. Let's see if this works. Um, oh my goodness. This baby. <laughs> this baby. I'm telling ya. Whoop. Right there. <sniffs> Lots of baby in there. Lots of baby. Okay, what's next?